Hello and welcome to my updated Minecraft world. We all know um, I built the birdhouse, my very classic structure. We've got a lovely dog kennel down here. We can see the hothouse from here. I'm not going over towards it because it's starting to crash the game a bit. Actually quite a lot. That one structure, you wouldn't believe it would you? Um, we have a lovely, uh, other now. Sugar cane farm. It's starting to get dark, but that's alright. And um, some new ornaments I've added. I kind of like that. Uh, but the key thing, actually, I'm quite happy to go in dark because then I can show you this. I need to wait for it to get a little bit darker though first. Because you can. Um, yeah, there's my um, old spawn area. Anything gets trapped in there, uh, they're not getting out. It's like two foot deep inside there. <laughs> no, I mean, I dug really far down, so you can't get out or whatever. we are watching mobs and all sorts get stuck in it. <laughs> I'm cruel sometimes. Go on, go down some. Go down. Down, 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 down. No, seriously, down. Pushing your hand down doesn't help, I've noticed. Uh, I haven't got much on me either, so... Ah, it's dark enough, right. If you can see that, that's kind of cool in it. You see the lighting all the way up there. Let's go and see what that is because I thought I want to go and explore new worlds. I'm not going to go by boat though. I would rather have a path there which I can get back with. Yep, simple enough. But I didn't want to build a bridge so I built an underground water passage. I kid you not. This place is cool. Plus, I came up with a new way of uh, lighting place. This never gets any spawns in it, even with this lighting system. Two torches up below glass. It stops it from flooding. Uh, it stops it from taking out all the candles with them under glass. So it's pretty good. And here it is. My underwater bay. Well, base. <laughs> it's going to be that eventually, but at the moment it's a connecting tunnel. But it's pretty cool. Uh, this is where I first started. Uh, by the way, if you want to try this out, I suggest then it's peaceful for a bit until you get the hang of uh, jumping backwards and forwards from outside water back inside. <laughs> yeah, plus you want to dig down um, quite low till you hit the water level anyway. This goes straight through uh, like a mountain. That was sorry about that. Uh, like I said, the hot house is really bugging the game out, so <laughs> I've got a. Um, I've got to be quick at getting down here. My own fault for putting so much fire, uh, so much lava, I should say. Uh, but yeah, this goes the full stretch underwater until I hit new land. This, in particular, is where I am going to set up a underwater uh, mining area. When I was building this, I found tons of resources. Um, I've pretty much used all the diamond up now, but I had quite a bit from just doing this. This is uh, this is still under construction. This bit I've only just made it to this island, which was kind of cool. Uh, this one's a lot deep, lower underwater as well, but I did get some built. I got a well. Ah, uh, go away! Not like your can. Go well over here. Very nice. It's a deep well as well. You can still see the hot house, but it's a new world plus a new house. Yay! I love this as well. I took. F I had a vision in my head of what I wanted, and I found it. We have the fire pit in the middle. My throne at the back here. Let's sit down for five. Put my feet up. <laughs> Some moderate resources. Um, furnaces, crafting bench. Um, what to call them? Chests. <laughs> Stairs up to the next floor. Balcony so I don't fall in. A lovely big roof, and I thought that were there more to keep it centered, but I kind of liked it, so I'm leaving it in. It's pretty funny though, as well, because there's no glass in this house at all. I didn't want any glass, so the it's an open roof at the top. So if it rains down, it's a right racket. I'm thinking I might seal in this circle a bit, but it might cause spawns, so I'm not sure yet. But um, great vantage point from up here. You can see everything of my old house over there, plus the underwater base, which I really like <laughs> a lot. There's loads of enemies down there today. Yep, I'm going to get killed. And my bed, in a lovely out 
doors. So nice, isn't it? Uh, next thing, I'm going to build. Um, I want to get up there, and I'm going to make, make a watchtower, a proper watchtower. It's just going to have four uh, chests with bow and arrows and enough uh, resources to last for ages. It's going to. I'm going to make it look like it as well, because these surprisingly work very well. These are just fence posts. These. They work well though, if you could get four of them five enough away, um, it would look like it stood up. It would look well good. That's the idea anyway. But yeah, so, my new home. And I'm working over here because it's less laggy. And it doesn't crash as much. <laughs> like I said, that's due to the hot house, my own doing. But I kind of wanted to build it. And that kind of still needs repairing. But anyway, thank you for checking out my new home. My new crib! Guy, no, I think it was. I'm gonna have this. <laughs> I'm off back inside. <laughs> anyway, thank you, people, for watching. Oh yeah, it's a fire pit for a reason. And if they ever make it so um, fire needs ventilation, I've got beautiful ventilation for it. And good night.